tenements. Exactly what are tenements? Is it supposed to be just like something along the lines of dormitories, like places for people to live or something like that? I get the feeling that that's what it is, but I don't get the, I don't quite get the, that kind of vibe out of it from this level, just the way that it's designed. Okay, there's those guys. I really want to take those guys out. I would if I had bloody bullets for the chain gun, but yeah, you know, 10. That's totally going to get rid of 700 de imps. Okay, uh, now we have to go get a red key right off the bat here, which is down there. The problem is if I walk past this, this section is going to close off and I have to deal with a whole bunch of enemies, including pain elementals. And I would rather not have to deal with that immediately. But I'm going to have to deal with that immediately. Because literally the only other thing I can do is take out the demons that are in here. And that's about it. You know, in all this time I've actually forgotten that as long as you have, that while you have the Berserk Pack active, you can pick up barrels and throw them. I completely forgot that that was a thing. Maybe it's not a thing anymore. It should be a thing, because it's an awesome thing. But it may not be a thing. Because you know it's a thing. Okay, um, I really want to throw a save here, uh, yeah, throw it over there, because I don't want to have to frickin' get screwed over, which is almost certainly what's fucking happening. Oh my god, this part sucks. Okay, cat threat is now minimal. Thank you, BFG, you are my problem solver forever. Now, something else in there, so, grenade that sucker. Ugh. Alright, now, is there anything else that we have to, have to deal with? Okay, cool, that door opens up again. And I believe right down there is a TP. Uh, why did I click right there? What the hell? God, now I've got to keep the segment just for that. Alright, um... Head on in here. Now there's probably some kind of enemy that's gonna gun at me. Good for me to be able to take care of those guys before I have to actually deal with them when I get the blue key, which is over there. Like, there it literally is right there. Oh god. Come on, tell me that they're gonna hit something. That's not me. Okay, they're gonna hit stuff that's not me, so I'm content with that. How is he, like, getting shots off? Come on. Whatever. I'll deal with him later. Because there's that part i got to deal with. So hit that, because there, there's that. And of course, he's got to be the sole survivor of the bloody barrel furor or some shit. Um... Oh, go away. Oh, go away. Like, come off it, seriously. Okay, are we done? Are we done now? Are we good? Well, it looks like we're about to find out about that uh, barrel theory. Throw a save in case it's not the case. Okay, cool. Wow, we're moving incredibly slowly. This is actually really, really bad. That sucks. I like being able to just... Oh, crap. Okay, looks like we've just lost the... What the hell? What the hell is this? What the hell is this? Wow, that's actually a pretty shitty bug. I'm actually going to be moving slow as shit for the rest of this level. That's actually kind of terrible. Um, let me actually reload that and just not bother picking that up. Okay, so now that we've actually got our uh, quick speed back. Uh, Mark, you're going to have to have a bit of a um, look at that one, because that actually kind of sucked. You know, I reckon with all the success he's had, the creator of this, he should make his own like fast food chain. Call it Mark Donald's. I think I made that similar suggestion to Markiplier. But it's just like... 
it's a really stupid pun, but for some reason I feel like it has to happen. Even I'm not entirely aware of why that is. I mean, like, until about maybe an hour or so ago, I thought I wasn't doing yu tubing anymore, and then I just sort of decided, you know what, I'm reviving myself. I'm just going to take a bit of CPR and whatnot and just be like, yep, I'm going to record more crappy-ass videos. No rockets. I need a lot more ammo in order to succeed with the rest of this game. Um... Okay, so if I throw it, then I get the speed back. It's just if you switch if you switch a weapon, yeah, like if you, if you switch ammo, if you switch a weapon, you drop the uh, barrel. You don't get one back. You don't get it back. It doesn't like appear on the ground near you or anything like that. And you maintain your slower speed. That makes it seem as if like you are still carrying the, the weapon. That's actually kind of lame. Oh, jeez. So is this. It's off. Okay. So, anyways, taking more advantage of weirdness with the engine. We got rid of everything up here. Good. Okay. Um, I'm not entirely sure if there is a meg if there is um a mega sphere here. I think I will just grab the heavy armor. Making the decision on that after I grabbed it. Um, that's a thing, right? Okay, cool. You get even more armor. I actually really, really want these bullets. Um, okay. Oh, that, okay, so that switch actually works with that. Okay, that's actually a little bit better. And this is also awesome because it's a secret. Good thing I've got these, uh, bullets. That'll do. Just repeatedly do a whole bunch of all that sort of crap. I... Phrasing. I need to work on that. Really, really do. Alright. Um, is there anything else out... Oh god. More cacks. You dead? Yeah, you're dead. Wait, is that a... That is, in fact, a Megasphere up there. Okay, that's cool. Now that I know that, that that's there... Hit that. Is there anything else down there? No, that looks like there was just the one PE that I managed to flush out with a grenade. These hand grenades are friggin' awesome. Um, let me actually... Awesome. More splat. Even more splat. Where's the splat? Whatever. Let's go get the blue key and actually head into that door. I think we're going to be met with a lot of skirmishing as soon as we enter that room, so... Uh, better get mentally prepared for that. Also, how to um, get this. I actually have no idea how one would get to that. Yeah, I don't want to have to deal with a chain gunner. Take cover. Looks like we're going to get in some nice uh, precision headshots. Alright. You know what? I think I just completely missed those imps and got and ended up getting the arachnotrons behind here. Where's the cacks? Where are our cack? Where are the cats? Yeah, you can hear the arachnotrons. Okay, um Oh yeah, that's right, these exist. Alright. Tell you one thing though, um, despite the fact that I tenderized that arachnotron with the um, with the grenade, that actually did a pretty decent number. That was awesome. I actually thought it was his leg, but it turns out it was his whole body. The placement of that grenade must have been such the momentum just kicked, sent it flying in in, in my general direction. That actually was, that is actually what made that part awesome. Okay. Okay. Cool. More advantage taking of weirdness in the engine. Can I punch you? Okay, cool. Sweet. And he walks straight over and joins me in battle. Okay, he's just got a rifle, but it's fine. He was good. If he had another weapon, he'd have lost it um, in the transition to the next level anyway. At least this way. 
I've got myself a nice little helper to take care of these arcane elementals that I know are coming up soon. You as well. Yeah, that was a dickish thing. Can I, like, kick that hard or something like that? I'm pretty sure I can, yeah. Because I'm pretty sure if you destroy these bodies and whatnot, you do actually get bonuses out of them, so... They're very minuscule, but, eh, you could well hang on with, like, two points of health and be like, okay, it's a good thing I actually took care of that other thing. I'm guessing the explosion must have just caused those lost souls that generated to just automatically die. That's a good thing. Because I don't want to have to deal with those guys. One of you. Piss off. Okay, so that down there is then pretty much rendered useless. There's that part, which... I wouldn't mind picking up some of that ammo, but I'm not actually going to go for it because I don't need to and I don't want to be bothered having to backtrack. Uh, uh, okay, got it. So now we can stare at the uh, Soul Sphere longingly. It's fine, I'm already maxed out on HP and I'm going to get a Mega Sphere anyway. So that's not that big of a deal. Um, this part though... Uh, yeah don't like this part because when I get it to that outside area, shit's just going to open up and I'm going to get freaking flanked from left, right and center. It's going to suck. Okay, we're taking care of the Revenant. Yeah, he's dead. Okay. There appear to also be a handful of... Oh, hello. Those suckers down there. Um, I suppose I could leave those to the care of my soldier dude. Because... Then, like, when I cross a certain line death, that's gonna happen. Oh shit, I didn't know there was a pain elemental in among those guys. Right. Come on. Come on. Come on. What the hell? Why are cat. Oh jeez. I'm surprised the, uh, s that such the low amount of, uh, damage I'm taking here. Like, what the hell? I think I had 200 and I'm now down to like 170 something. That's somewhat awesome. I appear to have lost my soldier though. Must have been cooked alive by a Cathedemon blast. Okay, um. There's a way to get over there. Which I believe is something along the lines of this. Yeah, there it is. Uh, that's going to take us to another BFG. Continuing the uh, streak. You're going to just die in a rather regular way. So are you. Uh, don't need that chain gun. I don't think it's really worth it. I've got to go up here though. That's going to suck because this pillar is unfortunately hollow and inside is a notch file. Die. Die. Thank you. Oh shit. Ow! Come on! Thank you! Considering I hit him with a BFG blast directly, if he didn't die from that one shotgun blast, I would have been A, pissed off, and B, dead as shit. That would have caused much rage. Okay, um... Uh, I'm, gonna actually, I'm actually gonna have to throw a save here. Because I don't have... Yeah, this is the best rapid-fire weapon I've got, so I'm going to have to deal with that. And... That. Okay, cool. You're, you're, you're screwed. Okay, the rest of this level is easy as piss. You just have to basically go back and forth between these um, tunnels, and when you run into this texture, it means that there's no further... Um, accessibility from that. So you basically just do this again and again and again and eventually you will find your way to the exit. So we keep doing that over and over and over. These are the last few enemies of the level and then now that that's out of the way all I've got to do is head back down here. Just missed it but it's fine. I'll catch it on the way up. This will take us to the Megasphere that we saw earlier, which also reveals the third and final secret of this level. Okay, we're going to have to go and go back the other way here. 
which means we're at risk of fucking taking acid damage and ruining our um perfect 200 but we managed to navigate that without taking any damage cool so we are in a very good position going into the next level off we go and who actually gives any knobs of goat shit about the uh, soul sphere that we missed well I mean if I wanted 100% items I probably should have gone after that soul sphere but whatever it's not that big of a deal next time we are in what I believe is known as the courtyard so see you for that